Hello everyone, Rissy Toothpick here, back again with some more End Zone A World Apart. And uh, during the last video, uh, everyone got sick, as you can see, and uh, we got some issues here, but I think we might be able to save a few for the better of the colony here. And uh, you know, just if a few die, a few die, you know what I mean? But yeah, no, hopefully we can actually uh, survive here. I don't know. It's not looking good, though. Um, if, I, if I knew what I knew now, we could probably turn this around. We probably wouldn't have the issue we have now. But I think the big problem was that we started making radiation suits when what we really needed were probably neck scarves and just kind of like pump them out for everyone. But, you know, it is what it is. People are mad. Food is uh, is a problem because people are just, you know, dropping like flies out here. But water, water's pretty good right now. So, I mean, that's good. Um, and, like, do we even worry about food? Because people are just going to keep on, like, falling here. So, I think what we do here is... Um, I mean, what can we do here? Let me look what we have. I mean, we can do a market. Distributing all of the resources in the settlement. I mean, I don't know if that's good or bad, but I mean, we can, we can try it, put it in. Maybe it's beneficial. Maybe we'll put it like right there. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what goes on there. I'll say this is my first time playing, so we can also kind of experiment. Maybe this is a terrible idea, especially with the issues we have right now. Like, like 15. I mean, that's uh, 15 out of 32. I mean, that's not bad. Well, let's get more. Let's get one more builder, and let's get another fisher. Because they can just get products from, like, right there. And we might actually think about putting another fishing hut down in this lake and when we're thinking about that let me do this again where I'm looking for the hunter's lodge gee chief we really don't need that much wood was that some kind of contest failed mission another failed mission 350 I mean there's still some food there which is good an oncoming drought, but it looks like it's going to be a short one, which is good because we can't have another long drought. We will not make it through. Let me think here. We need, okay, we have all these guys taken care of, so I think we put one in technician. The medic sick? Oh, you got to be kidding me. Even the medic has got problems. He has 15 visitors in there like half the colony went in there to get like help like this is not good there's some deer running through the uh, the city catching our disease or did we catch theirs low food reserves I mean let me look here Oh, well, we do need another farmer, so you know what? Mostly, let's get the orchard going. That might be a reason there. With the drought, how is our water? Ooh, it's pretty rough, so we might want to put someone... Man, I don't like doing this, but I think we put somebody in the irrigator. The irrigator is on low, so hopefully... It just kind of keeps it... I guess like a little moist, I want to say. That's probably what I want to try to get, is moist here. So I want to kind of see him in action if something happens. It's not looking good, though. Where is your worker at? Okay, there she is. Goes, activities and info, goes eating and drinking. You have a family. You never got with someone in your old. Okay, and this isn't 
really producing well as I, you know, as well as I thought, but we'll just watch it. I want to kind of get pretty much a good number so we don't have to worry about our water being. But I mean, I think we might as well just take her off to be honest. Like by the time we do get it, we're going to be out of water. So just wait on that. We have plenty of water in storage. It's just, I guess it's not being it's not being like moved to the storage rooms or whatever. So that might be an issue. Let's probably get another water carrier maybe. I mean, they do have to walk pretty far to get over here. Build and repair. Oh, so that's, that's this is kind of like the builder's room here pretty much like this is what they have to do so they're probably repairing items too while we're doing all this tools are like really good we can probably actually stop here like the workshop is not needed for this moment he was a we need a mortician Ooh, and a, I guess that's for the uh, the market is a Yep, distributes all resources in the market. Let us... Who do we not need here? Uh, we kind of need everyone. Oh... No, let's wait. we got to wait anyways for that to be... Taken care of. We do got another villager. Food is going down. Let's get him there. Do we have somebody in the... Gathering hut? No, we don't, so... Let's put somebody in there. Just kind of get a different food item. And I think, ooh, really bad right now. Hey, you know what? We, we can't even like waste the water here. Like we have to hold onto the water as well as we can. It is gonna rain though. So hopefully we can survive until then. But yeah, we're living off of whales right now. And since we are, I want to kind of push one down there, get one in the other well. We got another guy, put him in the, as a water carrier. Okay, nobody, we don't need teachers. Nobody needs education right now. Lives are on the line. The lake is empty. But at least, you know what? Everyone's not sick anymore. You know, we got that taken care of. Increase your population. I don't think we're in a position where we want to increase our population. But we're starting to get rain. Radiation is going away. Still a few people with contamination, but what can we do? Okay, uh, water is, uh, I mean, I don't even know what water is doing right now, but it's not great. Let's take a tailor, put them in the market. Has the market been built yet? No, it hasn't. We need wood. How's wood? Oh, no. Wood's down. That means we don't need one of you, but what we need is food. And actually, yeah, we'll make you a fisher. Watching this, like, hopefully we do not get a drought for a couple of days. Because we need the rain. But hopefully with this market, maybe it can help us um, control our inventory and supplies better. We do need somebody in the Forester. But my god, we're about to run out of, we're about to run out of water. I think what we probably need to is more uh, rainwater collectors. Like I think that might be an issue. Let's get those going. And then let us put in dirt road. I'll say we might as well. 
hopefully we can uh, survive this uh, encounter we find ourselves in. Let's do that. Turn the screen. Hey, you know what? Yeah, might as well. Make it look nice. We're, uh, we're barely getting by with the water we have. Food is low. And, like, really all we have is a gatherer. But let's see here. Like, I kind of want to see... Let's go to Honey Lodge. The Honey Lodge is kind of, you know, doesn't have that much food there. 680 right there, though. So let's move them there. But let me look at food. Is there one that can give us a lot of food? Yeah, all right. I mean, it doesn't matter. Maybe we need more cultivation fields. But the problem is, is like when you have a drought, it's like done and over with. But I mean, if we can have our food taken care of, we won't have to worry about it. So I think what we do is we put in a little field here. Never mind, we can't. Okay, we can put a little one in here. Do we want to do that though? Let's kind of move it up one. I mean, is that even worth it? That's the problem. Uh, you know what? I think, let me look at roads here. Let's go with a dirt road. We got roads here. So what we can do is we can come in here with a food cultivation field right there. We'll do a nine by, well, now we'll go, we'll make a giant one. 16 by 16 right there and then we'll have another we'll have another fishing hut probably as close as we can get it without taking efficiency hit thinking about right there we'll do another fishing hut there And I'm thinking, okay, how's our water? Ooh, our water's bad. Cause we don't, we need builders going here. Get builders, what are we missing there? They just need to build it. So let's get those builders doing that rainwater catch in. Cause I think we can catch a lot of water here. And we might need to get another water tower Wait, we have one, don't we? Yeah. Let's get that going. I mean, our charcoal is like through the roof. Maybe with these new fields, we can get going here. Because, I mean, we're growing things that don't take long to grow, you know? It's just, it just doesn't give us a lot of food. So I think what we're going to do with this a cultivated field here. I think we're gonna actually do the opposite. We're going to put something in there that takes a while. So when we do get the items, like our food will just jump. Water is terrible. Okay, these rainwater things are going at it. Once we get a little bit of rain, I think that will be good. But yeah, look at that production limit 38. like maybe with another cistern like right here possibly what does that do a cistern collects and stores water this building requires a jetty a well or a rainwater collection collector to function i mean we got all that around so hopefully that works let's do another dirt road Okay, we are, we got a little bit more water. People are unhappy. We got contaminated 
people again. We are making scarves so everyone can get those, which is good. So with that amount, 41, I think we go to the next one, which is the gas mask. Refinery, a refinery simultaneously separates metal, cloth, plastic, or electronics from scrap. Oh, so that's like a better one than the recycler. And all we need is wood. Let me look what we have here. A technician. Who's our technician? Makes tools. How's the tools? Tools are good. We don't have to worry about that right now. I think we want to build a refinery and we might, you know, get rid of the recyclers. How big is the refinery? Ooh, it's pretty big. It's a lot bigger than I was I thought it was gonna be. Let me kind of see. Is there any place where we can fit it real nice? Not really. Well, maybe right here. Let's turn it. Yeah, we can do it like that, maybe. About right there. And then we have a pathway to the back. Let's put that down. We're going to want it anyways. They can slowly, like, build it. Okay, we're here. Let us get... What do we need? We need more... More water carriers. Like, my god. We're barely getting by. And then... Dirt road. Hopefully that works. I don't know. Let's see. We just need more water carriers because these guys pretty much are at their limit. I do like those builders though. We'll take one builder away, put them in water carrying. A drought is coming in like three days, so we need to get this water situated by then. Ooh, there's a dead deer in that lake. I don't think that's a good thing. And what we got here? Highly contaminated rain. Holy smokes. Yeah, people would be getting sick then. Okay, let me remove radiation. This yellow stuff has to go. Like, I wasn't thinking we are getting contaminated like this bad of stuff. Let me just kind of work it out. The little green stuff we can, like, we have no problem with. It's the yellow stuff that we're not really ready for just yet. Okay, that should be fine. We're actually kind of unlucky, too, because that yellow could have been anywhere, and it just kind of fell right on us. Let's go there. Water's bad, but everything else, you like look at everything else. Everything is good, really. Uh, we need more people. 34 refiners. Oh, did the did they make this? They did. Oh wait, that's the market. It's got food in it. It needs a lot. Wait, where are we getting? Is it, did this one open? No, but that's why. So what we need to do here is we probably need to take. Hmm. Let's take a refiner. Let's take two of them. Like we don't need them really. Let's put these guys in the market. Let's get the market going. I think that's what it is. Needs food. Well, it's all right. They can they can go throw things in there. Uh, the deer are checking out the this the little village. He's liking it. I don't know what he's doing. He's like beating up on that uh, rainwater collector. Stockpile. Yeah, this like we really need people to start doing their jobs here. I need more water carriers. The refiners. We have these two guys going, which are making cloth and plastic. That's pretty much the basic necessities. But I do think we're slowly getting ourselves out of the water and food issue that we found ourselves in. 
I think all we do, all we need is just more people as uh, water carriers. Is this thing? Nope, cheap. You know that increasing the population is more work than cranking up a number, right? Girl, we can barely keep everyone, you know, full of water. Like we we cannot need, we do not need more people here. Three point five thousand. Like, what's the point of making beans? Uh, well, beans are seventeen fifteen. So potatoes. I don't think potatoes take that long. But let's put them on there. Let us get. We need another farmer. Actually, apparently we need 12 farmers. Why do we need 12 farmers? What did I, what did I make that needs 12 farmers? Oh, contaminated resources? Well. Oh my. Yeah, it would. All of a sudden, we get the... My god, we got all this bad stuff coming in here now. Everyone's going to start getting sick again because we don't have... I mean, we do have the face masks, which are good, but... It ain't one thing, it's another. Let me look for... Yep, this guy. Medium level radiation, that's what we need, so... Once people start getting that, I think we'll be good. Okay, how is our hunters doing? Oh, wrong one. 170, so we need to change the field. 790, go for the deer that are chilling in our village. Need to get rid of them before they attack someone. All right, let me check it. Let me look at the, the water here real quick. Food is going down a little bit. I think we take two people off and like get them pushing water. Like I don't think the well keeper is what we really need right now because I think everything's got water. It's just it's not getting you know stored pretty much. So let's do that and maybe we need in more water towers. I mean, the problem is I don't know if that will fit. You know what, let's just kind of get rid of it, actually. Let's not even worry about it. Okay, yeah, but like these things are like full of water. The wells, the wells make good water, but it just takes forever. And the only time they're needed is when there's a drought. We do need more metal. Is that what we need? Metal? Wow, we're really close to, so I think... I think when y'all make metal, and hopefully we can get it before we run out of uh, plastic. Oh, we have a good amount of plastic. Yeah, power line connects buildings. What does that do? A solar collector generates a certain quantity of power in order to supply the building hooked up to the power grid with electricity. The question is, is like, how, what does electricity do? Does it make it like better pretty much? That's what I want to know. We're going to find out. What does solar collector... I mean, where do we put it? Do we put it right here? Right in the middle? Our grid within range. So, we need it to power something. I guess we'll have it powering the uh, trader, but what we'll do is we'll put holes in. Hole in. Hole. This is a good idea? I don't know, but we're going to find out. But I think that will get, like, really almost everything.
We'll see. I mean, whatever they build, but we're gonna need more metal. Or more, yeah, more metal, regardless. And I mean, they have a lot to do here. We're back in a drought. Meaning that we need more people that we do not have on the wells. Well, it is raining. I mean, or it's not, but it will. But I mean, like I said, I think there's still, there's still like a lot of water in storage. So I think what we need to do is get everyone like moving it. Cause I think that's our issue. Like inventory is hundred percent. Oh, and a sandstorm at the same time. Uh oh. I mean, everything else, I, I don't think nothing's broken, which is good, but that really snuck in on us there. But yeah, let's get them to move this water because we have a plenty of storage here. Like, there's like at least 2,000 of water, like just, just chilling. <sighs> Cellars are contaminated because we got bad, very bad radiation now. Very bad. Like, my god. And how is this? Is it just bad here? No. It could be actually worse. Oh, so we're actually very lucky. Let's try to Cut all that radiation out, hopefully. I'm hoping we'll get like a nice uh, rain that will kind of wash all this away. And we can get everyone going in a good direction. Still have a mortician. Yeah, I think the radiation though is starting to kind of slowly go down. How's this going? Hasn't even been started on. More stags are coming in to be hunted. And it is raining. Okay, what's going on? We are low water source. We still got people, we still got things that are like full of water, so they just need to be transported. Let's see what else we can build here in the future. Oh, battery, that's pretty neat. Battery, what does the battery do? Stores energy during the daytime and returns it to the power grid at night. Oh, that might be nice to have. Maybe we need a pub, just kind of like make everyone happy. Oh, level. The weather station enables the decision to be made at which rain contamination levels, level fields, and rainwater collectors should be covered. Additional, additionally, it provides a rain contamination forecast. Oh, so that could tell us, like, hey, cover the plants. Radiation's coming. Maybe we should have some sturdy homes. All right, what's going on? Oh my, yep. Like, I, but like I've been saying, I don't think it's a, it's that we don't have water, it's just that we don't have people pushing it. Like, I think that's the issue. Now the food issue though, that needs to be solved. Oh man. How is y'all's? Like, where does the water go? That's the question. To these things, right? Like, I think once this, like... Oh, there's the water. 
So it goes to the market. I mean, there's not a lot there, but there is a little bit. I think we just kind of trust our people here and just let it go. Like we're dealing with the radiation right now. We got plenty of water that's in like storage that needs to be moved. And I mean, I'm, I'm just gonna put the settlers into water carrying and maybe that will slowly, slowly get us out of it. But other than water, everything's relatively good other than wood. And the wood, I mean, we only got one guy working real hard. Let me actually look for the, where is our, well, can't find it. Hold on, let me look at it here. Uh, Forrester, there's Amanda, where's she going? going home now she's going to the village medical facility scrapyard school there he is okay so about 348 remaining there it's not bad it's just that we only have one person working it, and that's the problem. But yeah, so we're going to stop here today. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, we're trying to get everything going here, but we're definitely, you know, getting hit by a little bit of a, a radiation issue. And uh, hopefully we'll get it fixed in the next one. But I'll see you all again in the next one.